Hello, I'm Richard Ridge for Broadway World. Roundabout Theatre Company continues their season with Mike Bartlett's play, Love, 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 directed by Michael Mayer. And we caught up with the company on opening night. Well, first of all, I want to welcome you for your New York stage debut. How does it feel? It feels great, actually. It's nice to come with a play which is so kind of buoyant. It's been like a tonic for me. I'm normally playing kind of miserable anxiety on stage, so this is a very different role for me. But yeah, the audiences are fantastic, and they stand up at the end, and they're very engaged with the play, which is a British play, so it's kind of refreshing and surprising. How did this all come about for you to do this play here at Roundabout? It was really accidental. I'd returned from Berlin back to New York, and I live here now. Um, and I'd, I'd been in to see my agent, and I said, look, I really want to do something different, something different to what I usually do. I'd love to be able to work here. I've always loved the Roundabout. And he said, well, as it happens, I've got this script on my desk, made the call, and then here we are. Um, it's really, we have a wonderful group of friends and family here, so it just, we're, we're in good hands tonight in the audience, so it just, it feels a relief to kind of be over this uh, mark right now. And now to be open. Yeah, it's nice, yeah. yeah. What has it been like working on this show? I mean, you have Michael Mayer, one of the greatest directors, Mike Bartlett. Yeah. What was it like in the rehearsal room? It was, it was very, um, we had an amazing group. There was a lot of love and, uh, and there, was, there were no problems. Uh, there were no problem children in this play. Uh, and, and Mike, I, both Mikes are so short. I've known Michael Mayer since I'm 19 years old. And um, Mike Bartlett, I've, I've only been a fan of his writing from Cock to King Charles III. So I just feel very, very lucky to um, get to work with him and work with him on this, this play with this character. It's just such a gift. It is opening night. How do you feel? I love this play and I love this company. And I'm delighted to be back at the roundabout. So it's like, it, ticks all the boxes for me. It was a terrific night. I'm very happy. So tell me when you first read the play, what went through your mind, why you wanted to direct it? Well, when I first read it, um, it, it struck me that I hadn't read anything that had this form to it before. So I love the themes of generation dissonance and um, of economics and the way the culture moves forward for some people and moves backward for other others. Um, I loved the, the sound of it, the rhythm of it. I, it struck me right away the way the words were organized on the page. I knew right away that it was going to be something that would engage me. And then when I went further into it, as I kept reading, I thought, oh, wow, I, I actually really really I'm engaged by the story and it, and the way that it functions was so different from anything I'd read before. You're collaborating with your director Michael Mayer. He's brilliant. He's a genius. He's He's got a real sense of music and I think for my stuff that's brilliant because it's all about rhythm and rhythm leads to dramatic intention and all that's exactly what the actors are playing so the fact he understands that and he's very funny as well which is also important um it's been fantastic very nice uh, guy. working with michael he's one of the most trusting inventive sensitive directors i've ever gotten to work with and this company is outstanding i, I i've been really like fortunate to work with such hard working actors who really love love the craft of acting and, and that that's the most important thing to them. Um, I, I'm not saying that that doesn't happen often, like, you know, obviously actors want to work, but uh, there's a certain style of technique that all the actors in this company have, which is they're always exploring, they're always learning more, they're always trying to find something else out about their character, about a scene, and, uh, and it's been really fantastic to work on, on these beautiful words that Michael's written for us and, uh, well, not for us, but like for the, for the world and, uh, and, and with such a great group of people. You know, Michael has written this structured in a way, it's very rhythmic, the timing's very important. So we sort of worked from a place of starting by drilling the rhythm into our bones so we knew exactly what that rhythm was because without it, the show doesn't really work. And then as we've gone on and through the preview process, we're sort of fleshing out, finding the, the flesh and blood of the whole thing. Yeah, I love this play. I love this cast. It's so fun to do. Normally, I feel really anxious and nervous, but I feel really happy today. This is such a dynamite company, and you're working with Michael Mayer. What was it like creating this whole world with him in the rehearsal room? It was so fun. It was like putting a puzzle together every day. The play is really technical. Yeah. The language is really technical. So we worked in a really technical way, kind of almost like an outside-in approach. And I feel like really great about how, how we worked. And I loved working with Michael. I've wanted to work with him for a really long time. So I left at the chance. So when you took your bow tonight, do you remember what you were thinking? Uh, I remember thinking 
oh, they're taking pictures of me. I don't have a shirt on. 